I'm at Lava Beds National Monument. It's about 2.30 p.m. Pacific Daylight Savings Time on uh, Wednesday, May 10, 2017. I'm standing on the little butte that's just north of the visitor center. If you look below me there ahead, there's the parking area for the visitor center and then that little building on the other side of the U.S. flag blowing, that's the visitor center. Beyond that, or well, curving around to the left of that, both sides, that's the um, main road through the monument that's actually called Monument Road or Cave Monument Road. And then to the right of that is going to be the uh, way to Cave Loop Road. The buildings beyond the visitor center, that's where the rangers and so on live. And then to the left of that is going to be the campground and so on. And then the big hill way beyond, that's um, Caldwell Butte. Now before I go wandering around, I want to show you something. So, mm, darn it. So if you notice, there's a three-way intersection down there. And to the left there's a hole. That is um, one of the main caves. That's Indian Well Cave. And then, uh, let me go over here. See if I can get a better view. There's a lot of trees up here. It's probably why nobody bothers to hike up here. But if you look out there where cars are parked, that is the, uh, what's it called? Cave Loop Road. They're parked at the uh, entrance, one of the entrances to Sentinel Cave. I think that's the upper entrance to Sentinel Cave. But if you look to the left, you can see dark spots. Those are holes in the ground. That's where the caves are. Um, let's see here. Go to the right here. If you go to the right here, there's a, that's the way out to more caves. I'm going to go up here. There's trees blocking the view, so I'm just going to go ahead and walk up this way for now. Notice it's kind of flat up here. It's a bit steep getting up here, but once you're up here, it's kind of soft gravel. A lot of little trees. In fact, these are some of the tallest trees around here. So, not the greatest view. I'm heading north now. See if I can go up higher. So, I don't know the name of that big hill. I haven't been up on that hill yet. this way when I got up here I saw a cool bird and I'll see where it went it didn't fly away it just sort of wandered away I suspect there might be a road up here, but I'm pretty sure it's close to the public, so that's why I just walked. Huh. Weird. There's like vaults and stuff up here. Utility vaults, I'm sure. Wonder if that's for water? Drinking water? Weird. You know, I think I was up here a long time ago, but... So yeah, look at this. There's like a pipe here. It's open. That must be for vent. Some kind of weird. And then I'm on a concrete pad here. So there's Monument Road. That's the way north to the, uh, you know what. Um, wildlife Refuge. To the lake and stuff. Weird, there's some vaults over here. Utility vaults. Interesting. Confined space, enter by permit only. <laughs> Maybe I should go to the visitor center, ask for a permit, see what they say. Weird. Uh, there's some kind of guy wire here. I'm not gonna touch it. Yeah, I bet this is a water reservoir or something. Interesting. No sign, just random stuff. Okay. So there's, there's that mystery butte again. Interesting. Whoa, darn it, dropping stuff. There's a road up here. Let me look inside here. Fresh tire prints, people do come out here. Wentworth, no, Walworth. Yeah, see this has uh, got a vent hole in it too. Keep the animals out, but let air in and out. Why you need it? So here's here, right? Here's a solar panel and some sort of radio. Huh, lizard. 
interesting. Now let's see over here. Oh good, that's all six. Oh weird, it says sewer. Do they really pump their sewage up here? Weird. I suppose it's possible. I mean, their sewage has to go somewhere. You know what, I think I did come up here once a long time ago. Forgot all about it. Oh wow, there's a hole here. Not very far down, about four feet down. I wonder what this one's supposed to be. Okay, so here we are. That's the campground down there. Looks like there's a garbage can or dumpster or something down there. You can't really tell, but um, that's all flat land, but yeah, I'm sure there's more caves over there. We go this way just a second. Yeah, there's a road here. There's even a place for cars to turn around. Oops. So that's interesting. There's the mystery bunkers. Like I said, I bet it is for sewage, but whatever. So let me go up here. There's a road that I bet is um, Skull Cave, and then uh, what's it called? Uh, Lion's Trail. And then of course there's a couple small buttes out there, like the Three Sisters, and I um, can't remember the name of that other small butte. But yeah, it's a long walk out there, but take tons and tons of water. But if you do go out there, expect to see some interesting stuff. Yeah, this would be a neat road. Okay, so, and then of course that's Gonchin Butte up there. There's a trail all the way to the top and a lookout up there. So that's interesting. But yeah, I think I'm gonna quit for the day. But before I do that, there's a road out there. That's the way out to, um, oh shoot. You know, the uh, big crater and stuff. Can't remember, there's a cave out there too. I forgot the name, but it's on the map, you'll see it.